Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to buy Bitcoin on Binance. The first thing you need to do, once on Binance you are going to sign up. You want to create an account on Binance and to create an account is quite straightforward. All you will need is to enter your name, email address and also a phone number for verification process. Once you have done that, all you'll need to do now is go over to the top left hand corner, right where you see buy crypto. You are going to hover over that, then you will see the option pay with, and right where you see USD on my screen, you could tap right there, then you could search for the currency that you are using. Once you have found the currency, you are going to tap right where you see credit slash debit card. After you have done that, you will be redirected to a new page. All you'll need to do is select buy. Then from there, you'll see the estimated price for one Bitcoin. And again, depending on the currency that you have selected, I'm using USD. You will enter the amount that you want to spend. And the minimum amount of USD that I can spend is $15, as you can see right here. So let's say I wanted to spend $100 and you can see the amount of Bitcoin that I would receive. After doing that, all you'll need to do now is tap on continue. Once you have tapped on continue, you can see right here, 100 USD, the amount of Bitcoin that I will receive. Then you'll see bank card and from there you can add new card right here. Or if you would like to use different payment options, as you can see right here, they also offer Google Pay. And depending on where you're located or what type of device you're using, you may see other payment methods, for example, Apple Pay or so on. But let's say I were to use a bank card, I would, all I would have to do is tap on Add New Card. Then I would tap on Add New Card here again. After I've done that, I would be redirected to a new dashboard and all I would have to do is enter the card information right here. And once you have entered the card information, you will be able to go through with the transaction and you will now be able to purchase some Bitcoin. After purchasing the Bitcoin, what I want you to do next is go over to the top right hand corner right where you see your profile pic. You are going to tap right there. Then from the drop down menu option, you are going to tap on wallet. After you have tapped on wallet, from there you can select either overview or you can select fiat and spot. I'll select overview for this example. And this is the section on which you'll be able to see how much crypto token you have. So you'll be able to view the amount of crypto token you have right here and what is the value at the current market price. So by tapping on overview, you can see right here how much crypto token you have and also the current market price as you can see right there. And if in the future you would like to make a withdrawal, once on this page, I want you to pay attention to some stuff. So the first thing is you'll be able to see your estimated balance. Depending on which crypto token you have purchased, you will see the market price and so on by scrolling down as you can see right here. And also pay attention to the left hand menu option. So for example, if you would like to do some margin trading, you could tap on margin. You can also see your futures trading if you want. And also if you use trading bots, you could tap right there. And to go directly into and also, if you would like to transfer some crypto token from Binance to another crypto wallet, all you would have to do is simply scroll down or you could tap in the search bar right here and search for the particular coin. So let's say, for example, I want to transfer some Bitcoin. All I would have to do right where you see BTC, I'm going to hover over withdraw. I'll tap on withdraw right there. After you have tapped on withdraw, from here you are going to enter the other person's wallet address right here. Then you will enter the network and you will scroll down and you will enter the amount of Bitcoin that you would like to transfer. And that's it. So that would be how to transfer Bitcoin to another wallet address. And if the person is also a Binance user, all you would have to do is tap on Binance user right here. 
Then from there, you could transfer it via the person's email address, phone number, PID, or Binance ID. And also, if you are interested in the NFT market, you could tap on NFT right here and you could check out Binance NFT market. And by the way, to view the Binance market or view the crypto market better yet, all you would have to do is hover over markets at the top. Then you'll tap on market view. Once you have tapped on market view, you will be redirected to this page. And from here, you'll be able to see the new listing, the top gainers, and also the top volume coin. And you could scroll down and from here, you'll be able to observe or track the market as you can see right here. So you can view all of the crypto tokens that are currently listed on the Binance. And that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.